We at Audi think in terms of transformation in 360 degrees. On the road to become a provider of sustainable mobility, it is of utmost importance to create a sustainable value chain. From the first manufacturing process until the handover to our customers and the end of life of our car. We do our best to continuously improve all processes. When it comes to the Audi Q8 e-tron, we have a perfect example for an end-to-end -end CO2 neutral value chain. Let's start at the CO2 neutral production site in Cure. The electric drive of the all-new Audi Q8 e-tron will be produced at the Hungarian site with the largest on-site rooftop solar panel park in Europe. Audi Hungaria is also the biggest user of geothermal energy in the country. CO2 neutral electric drive production in all steps, based on renewable energy, fully electric, high level of automation. And when we talk about a holistic approach, we mean it. We continuously improve the energy efficiency of all our autonomous, fully electric driving transport systems at our factory. As well as all equipment and packaging, we constantly increase the share of reusable packaging and use new packaging technologies. Connecting the different steps within a production network is one of the key factors. We also started the delivery of battery modules by CO2 Neutral Train in 2022 from Hungary to Brussels. Arriving in Brussels. Since 2018 worldwide, the first certified carbon neutral high volume premium production facility. E-mobility sustainability, and digitalization everywhere. We use progressive technology for the top model of the electric SUV segment. We make a clear statement with every step of the production. Perfection into the smallest details, from battery manufacturing to powertrain assembly until the wedding. And at the end of the journey, we create a masterpiece, the brand new Audi Q8 e-tron. At Audi, we define sustainability to be a clear competitive advantage. Within the Audi production network, we create a clear path towards sustainable production and push towards zero emissions.